I wouldn't have known if you hadn't put Redfield next to Chris. Yeah, to be fair. He just fucking regenerated a heart, hasn't he? <laughs> His hands, fingers are back. <laughs> what the fuck, man? <laughs> Is he in, like, the oh. big consciousness or something, you know? I think so, yeah. It's cold. Dude. How did I get here? God, it's freezing. This Pretty shit. Cold. My body. Yeah, I agree. Ellen? How are you here? You're dead. <laughs> yeah. Dead? Uh, I mean, Miranda. She. Uh, no. I still have to save Rose. Wrong! <laughs> it wasn't Miranda. You were always dead. What are you saying? I can still... See? Miranda didn't kill you. You mean you didn't think it was weird? No matter how much you got hurt? Remember? Baker House. You were murdered by Jack. You died there three years ago. That's that's impossible. No way. You shouldn't even be able to walk around. Quit messing with my head. You shouldn't be walking. Screw <laughs> you! What, what am I? I, I, I did all that. <laughs> Rose. Mia. I... We're seeing some big revelations, bro. Revelations. Lots of them. Let's see where this goes. <laughs> yeah, this is intriguing. Mm. Uh, oh, it's our boy. He saved us. <laughs> the Duke. At last, he awakes. 
were yes yes carriage, Ethan. you were having a nightmare Duke your battle with Heisenberg was a sight to see but to think Miranda would show herself how long have I been out not long till dawn Duke, I need a favor. Take me to Miranda. I assumed as much and I'm already on the way. Oh, Duke is such a boy. You should arrive what shortly. an absolute badass. <laughs> but Ethan, are you sure of this? Your body is, well, falling apart. Uh oh. <sighs> yes. I thought he was going to look down and have like no legs or something. <laughs> yeah. Speaking of foolish questions, who or what are you? <laughs> right, it's the Duke. Even I can't quite answer that. We're here. Man. I owe you one. Mr. Winters, I'm afraid you can't return to your old world any longer. Are you ready? Yeah, I have to be. Okay. I gotta go. Okay. All right, you do. You got anything for us? <laughs> Sniper rifle ammo, hell yeah. Explosive rounds, hell yeah. Oh, we've got all of our stuff. One more super weapon for the road, Duke? Yeah. <laughs> this will be the final chance to see him, I think. Yeah, I guess so. This guy is the best. He's awesome. Preparation is more important now than ever before. Ah, see, he does. <laughs> oh! Do I have Still enough? Not. Nope. I don't have enough. Don't have enough fish. Damn it. All right. wisely. Let's Your just quickly depend on it. do this, and do this, and do this. And do this. You know what? We haven't found any of the other shit. We may as well just fucking sell all of this shit. You know what I mean? Yeah. You know what I mean? Know what I mean? And we, we're probably not going to be doing any of this. You yeah. take my money! <laughs> You oh, know the me. assemblage of life and machine. <laughs> I can feel Lord Heisenberg's essence through it. All right. All righty then. Let's have a look at this. We could get that to... Let's get this dope shotgun, dude. Let's sell my uh, other shotgun, I think. Oh, excellent yeah. choice. Where's this shotgun? Right there. Uh, Sorry, little sir. Worry not. You can buy it back if you like. Let me just quickly. Please, be well. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks. Oh, what a fucking beast. I even beast. responded. What a fucking beast. Yeah, yeah. Naturally. Naturally, indeed, right. All right. Let's, let's beef up this bad boy. One moment, please. Oh, that's that's quite a lot for the next bit. We need to buy some ammo and shit, I think. Some health. Yeah. I saw you eyeing that one. I'm buy everything. Yeah. yeah. Bro, you haven't even used your rifle. <laughs> Bro, I got so... I love my rifle, dude. I use it all the time. You wouldn't even know. Okay. You're right. I know, bro. I know. Um, nah, don't need that. Okay. Rifle's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. What? Ah, it's fine. All finished. Okay. This may be our last meeting. Please, be well. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Mr. Duke. Thank you. Let me just... Let me just hit that save right there. 
Let me just have a look at this. Let's fucking go, dude. Let's fucking do this. Where, where am I going? This way? Hell it's Mother yeah. Miranda Merkin time. <laughs> <sighs> okay, I can't actually speed up, so now we're doing a we're doing a cool walk. Hmm. A cool walk through. Dramatic slow walk. Out of my way. Yep. It's alright, they actually are moving out your way, dude, so. That's pretty cool. Ah, oh, come on. I don't care, dude. Just no. Okay. <laughs> Whatever. Let's go. Keep going. Yeah. <laughs> Little Ava. Oh. My beautiful daughter. Come to me. Your cool finger. Is that you? Things. The rings, yeah. Oh, how I've missed you. What? <laughs> it's Rose. My power is leaving oh. me. Rose! <laughs> Miranda! Interesting. Your body certainly isn't normal. Give Rose to me. Now! You will see. Once I kill you properly, everything. Get her now! Cheers, Chris. Let go! I've spent a lifetime creating this moment. And you try to take it away from me. I will take what is due. My desires will be fulfilled. No. Rose is mine! What the fuck? You fulfilled your purpose. All right. You disposed of my false children and awakened the glorious of my sweet. Now, please do not worry, the little rogues. I assure you, I'll provide her with true happiness. I'm sure you will. So now you can die peacefully. Thank you. Ah. Do not let please, get away. Mr. Winters, stop struggling. What I shall look at that. Ooh. Okay, I was definitely supposed to hide behind the trees there. Yeah. How can you deny me? Why the hell can't you realize the spider? Rose is my goddamn kid, <laughs> not yours. Oh my god, you know. Yeah. That form kind of looks like the end. Of Your time is up. Now die. <laughs> it does, bro. It does. Need some, uh, some grenades. Some I have this thing. Hey, turn around. Thank you. All right. <laughs> I'm the I've never seen a human live without his heart. Are you sure? Oh uh, yeah. The yeah. Megamycete saved me from the pits of despair. Okay. It granted me this yeah. splendid power. Pretty cool. Pretty cool power. Yeah, right. All it's done is drive you nuts. Ethan's always got something to say, doesn't he? Yeah, he does. Alright, give me this. Uh. Die and be swallowed into the Mega My Seed! Okay. What else do we have? If she wasn't. Hey, Ethan, you've got a lot of uh, rifle ammo. We need to use some rifle ammo. <laughs> What's this? What's this? What? Okay, that was pretty cool. Oh, 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 oh. shit! Hi, oh. <laughs> what the fuck? I don't like this. 
Now, Mr. Winters, I think it's time okay. you left things in my hands. Oh, yes. Come on, walk the over the mines. Walk over the mines. I will take back my daughter! If oh! I <laughs> that fucking worked! Nice one, dude. Just with a mega mice. My daughter will be made manifest at last! Bro, you're Every about to blow the fuck up. A century! All for this day! Yeah. Who's dropping this up? Wow! Thanks for making cover for me. Yeah. Oh, he got her. <laughs> he got her. Okay, let's drop. I love these mines, dude. <laughs> yeah. After all, everyone. Save him for the final boss battle. Yeah, 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 of course, of course. How strong they are. Where is she? <laughs> Okay, Why she's got do you fucking. Surely you have no leaders now. So close to death. Dark Souls fucking spells where you get the yeah, three things over your head. head. Damn daughter, psycho. This. Is... Come on, blow up, blow up, blow up. Curse this <laughs> 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 I can take any form I desire. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Even your Let's reload. It's going quiet again. <laughs> do you know what we're going to do this time, guys? We're going to... Oh. Oh. <laughs> Alright, that's... Die! 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 No. No you. No you. <laughs> okay. I'm just gonna start firing off. Oh yeah. The villagers, those four years, they could oh, do yeah. nothing to assuage my ears. Okay. <laughs> what what are the big things do we have this? The loneliness. Ever think the problem might be you, Miranda? You're not capable of and then, we're gonna go over here. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, you have so many! I will see my okay, and then we're gonna grab our mine again, I right? Yeah. Here, put this down here. Oh, you're gonna get fucking forbidden suns again, bro. Oh, that's alright, I got my mine. <laughs> It's fine. <laughs> it's fine, dude. Go on, fly over here. No, you want to. <laughs> <laughs> What's my help? Why, thing? Seb? It's Why true. do you have to cheese the final boss of every die. RE game? Die. Oh, shit. I missed. Oh, you goofed there, man. Okay. My wish will come. No cheese, bro. No cheese. Just ease. Get down here! <laughs> Get down here! Right, we we can't really. Oh shit! I need to heal. You're not healing. No, I got two. I got two. Oh good. My favorite weapon, the rifle. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm sure by how much ammo you have for it. Yeah, so much ammo. Why is it? I got 69 shots. That's enough to hey. kill. That's enough to kill anybody. Any human. <laughs> I understand your feelings, Mr. Winters. Okay. Truly, I do. But this is the end for you. I will take back my daughter! Cease! What are you? <laughs> <laughs> this is the end <laughs> To ensure I never see you. I will feed you to the price. Every Wait, single Wait, dude. I did have to reload it all. <laughs> uh, uh, 
for real? <laughs> Ethan's way of just shoot your way into My out of any scenario actually works, bro. <laughs> Ethan, wake up. Oh, no. Chris. Ethan, you did it. It's finished. I think we've finished each other. Ethan, we gotta move. Moving, Ethan. There's a bomb in that thing that'll blow this whole village sky high. Hey, look at me. When I hit this trigger, we can't this be anywhere Resident near Evil it. Village Sky High. Ah, damn it! <laughs> Let me wait for you. She's alive. You hear me? Alive. Mia, I'm so sorry. I love you. Keep Rose safe. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> You tell yourself. Now come on, it's not that much further. Watch over her. Teach her to be strong. God damn. In terms of like shot composition, it's a, it is a bit weird that you don't see Ethan's face in like these scenes. Yeah. I get why they've done it, though. Ethan. <laughs> cool, guys. Look at explosions. Did you know that there was a charge? Am I going to see again? Rose. Uh, Chris told him. That, wait, Chris told Ethan that there was a charge on the on that big thing, right? Go. He never said that. Go, take us up now. I'm sure he did. He said this is this thing's got enough like explosions to blow the whole village. Wait. Mm. We have to get clear. No, we can't go. Not without my husband. Mia, sit down and strap in. Not before you tell me where Ethan is. I know he wouldn't abandon us. Tell me what's going on. Where? Down. Chris Where? loves giving instructions that nobody wants to listen to. <laughs> Chris, 
What have you done? He's gone. I tried. He stayed so we could all escape. I'm sorry. Captain. You need to see this. BSAA didn't send soldiers. This is a bioweapon. What the hell were they thinking? Orders, Captain. Pick up the rest of the squad. Plot a course for BSAA Europe HQ. Is that a zombie? Someone's gotta pay. Not necessarily. Looks like the RE2 and three zombies in it to me. And the Little. BSAA sent the bioweapons. Sent bio weapons. You know what I mean? Some T virus shit. Yeah, yeah. They have just been remaking RE2 and 3, so it makes <laughs> make sense of that, you know. You make the connections between the, uh, the monsters here. Yeah, yeah. I've been thinking a lot about this. I actually rewatched the uh, opening a few times just to like check it out. This animation is really great. So, dude. So, dude. Right. Um, <laughs> this might get taken out with DMCA, guys. You know the drill. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure. Right now, in this moment, I think I need some more time to think on it, but, like, I'm not sure if I enjoyed that ending. Yeah, it... It lost the horror aspect of it a bit more. I'm not sure if I enjoyed the uh, the reveals that we got. I kind of Ethan's been dead since Zari Seven, but they yeah. didn't explain. They didn't explain that. I guess that's for the next game, right? Let's make a trilogy. Um. What are your thoughts, bro? What are your thoughts? Um, it's it makes sense. Gifts we gave, like, but more you took. She snarled. So more, in turn, is due. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. Her parents, though, had searched all day and at last arrived. With rampant rage, father fought the witch, while mother's loving touch shattered the dark enchantment. But the witch was strong, and father yelled, save our daughter! So mother bore their child to safety, as the forest was consumed. Even now, the burnt forest is a grim reminder of father's sacrifice. To this day, any child who stares too long into the charred wasteland will be haunted by nightmares of getting lost while picking berries. Hello, my dear. Whoa. <laughs> That's cool. That's cool. <laughs> that was cool. That was cool, yeah. Yeah, it's technically and visually a very good game. That was, in uh, yeah, incredible. It's also fun to play, you know, the feel of it, the shooting and everything. Yeah. That felt all right. That felt good. Uh, not very different from RE7 mechanics-wise. Yeah. Narratively and geographically, though, 
And in terms of balance as well, left a bit to be desired. Um, narratively, they just fucking ripped the story from Dark Souls 3. <laughs> Which, like, don't get me wrong, don't get me wrong, that sort of stuff happens all the time in, in narrative literature. But it was very blatant. Like, it, like, when a story isn't comparable to its original inspiration, that's when it's done well. Okay, yeah, yeah. But but, but the fact that we saw so, so many parallels in this game compared to that There were a lot of parallels. Like, a lot of parallels. Um... So... Ethan dying and then taking playing as Chris, I guess, is to give you that power fantasy that you're just fucking destroying everything. Yeah. I it didn't feel cool to me personally. I, I was like, all right, let's just go through this. Now there's no tension anymore. Yeah. Well, that's what I kind of like the mercenaries most for some of the game. Yeah. Like, yeah. Playing as Hunkinari too, you know, just fucking plaster everything. Yeah. And like. So like, if they had the two separate things, I'd be fine with that. But it's. Mm. Oh, well, I, I guess it's not the biggest thing, but like, and they they probably did it to distance Ethan dying and then Ethan coming back, you know, so it wasn't just him dying and then waking up again and wherever he was. But they didn't explain that. They didn't. There's a lot left unexplained, and I'm sure that'll that'll be resolved later. Um, but as its own thing, it's it's fun, and there's lots of th fun themes that uh, may maybe I'm just not smart enough to to understand where like Ethan's fucking died in RE7, dude. Ethan died in RE7. <laughs> as as a standalone game, like. This, this is the problem with this RE game. If they were standalone titles, they'd be very good. But it was so incredibly convoluted, the, the explanations that they had for vampires and werewolves and fucking creepy puppet dolls. Like, it was so... The, the explanation was, this person got an experiment on them and this is just how they happen to react where they get these mad powers. Yeah. Whereas that was, you know, with with the with the T virus. To me personally, that made more sense. That you know somebody could just like maybe maybe get stronger, and like an insatiable, or turn into like a zombie if they're not that way inclined. <laughs> I don't <Yeah>. know. Ah. <laughs> <sighs> Yeah, like, in terms of where the gothic is concerned, and this was a very gothic saying, gothic character, um, very well done on that front. Like, there was, there's a lot of traits of the gothic in this. Like, there's the cursed bloodline thing, there's the uncanny, there's doppelgangers, there's a mixture of the romantic and the horrible, there's the anti-hero in Heisenberg, like, there's so much stuff. Like, if anyone is familiar with the Gothic and plays this game, they will see a lot of that stuff in here, which I appreciate very, Visually, well, very much. Visually, yeah, they've done a fantastic job. I have no complaints about the game, vi visually or mechanically. My, all my my complaints are all to do with the, the story. Yeah. Uh, which, again, they can, they can sort out. That's just me. If, if uh, p other people enjoyed that, that's, that's totally great. That's better, yeah, in yeah. fact. Um... Maybe I missed something here, but so uh, Miranda loses a child hundreds of years ago, walks into a cave, gets infected, right? And then she spends how ever many years building up these castles and these, uh, you know, medieval towns and stuff mm. without any of the rest of the world seeing this shit. There's no uh, Google. You, you. There's no Google Earth in fucking Resident Evil. You have it a bit twisted. Um, Do I have it twisted? This, whoever Mother Miranda was, Miranda, I believe was a scientist around the turn of the century. 
Okay. And she lost her daughter to Spanish flu. That was Eva. Yeah. Uh, she wa- wandered into a cave to die, and she discovered the mold. Yeah. And using that mold, she experimented on the villagers and the people in the village to see if she could find a host for, for Eva. Yeah. And in doing so, she managed to infect Lady Dimitrescu, Heisenberg, Moreau, and uh, Beneviento. They were like, they responded the best to the mold. Yeah. And they managed to manifest their powers in, in those ways. Okay. Everyone else turned to lichens. Um, the, the, the Kubo? Are they called K- K- Kubo? Kudo. Kudo. Um, they were a parasite that she made out of the mold as an experiment. And those Kudo guys turned into the... Um, they were the parasites that she used to, to enhance those powers, I think. Okay, yeah, yeah. Um, so, yeah. The the actual sort of takeover of the village has only been going on for about 100 years. Yeah, but that's what I'm saying. That's crazy, right? That, like, mm. a place like well, this would be under the radar for 100 years. In the it, techno- technological world of Resident Evil, where they have USB sticks in the 90s. It's... It, this, this game is set in what I assume are the Carpathian Mountains which are between, like, Romania, Hungary, Slovakia. It, I'm just are... saying satellites existed. <laughs> you know? Satellite yeah. nature exists. But what could you see from a satellite that looks out of the ordinary? Some dank-ass fucking castles that you can go and check out, dude. Yeah, but the, the, dude, the castles were already there. The castles were built way before all this shit ever happened. Mother Miranda didn't build the village or anything like that. People had just been living there. Right, okay. And she okay. found the village yeah, and yeah. then started performing experiments. Like, right. for example, the castle, that's been in the Dimitres bloodline for hundreds of years, assumedly. And once she got to the village, Alcina Dimitrescu was the current castellan. So she used the mold to influence her and uh, therefore get a, a foothold on the power of the village. Same with Heisenberg. He was a regular villager, assumedly. But he responded well to the uh, to the the, the, the kudo. So Heisenberg is just a cool dude, dude. Yeah, I loved Heisenberg. Heisenberg is great. Heisenberg's probably my favorite character in the whole game. Yeah, <laughs> Heisenberg was fantastic. <laughs> well, I can't. I still can't get over Ethan. Just that that was a bit bit of a turning point to, for me with the with the uh-huh. game there. Uh, Don't even get me started on Ethan as a character. <laughs> uh, right, should we see? Should we see what uh, Mia's up to? Yeah, see what Mia has to say. Do you think the little boy will be able to touch the moon? Nobody can touch the moon; it's too far away. Wait, what if he has a rocket ship? Okay, then you can touch it, but it'd be very, very cold. You were being silly. I don't <laughs> think the moon feels like a kid. I think it does, <laughs> but it's... I thought this was Mia. It's obviously not Mia. Is this Rose grown up? Hey, Dad. Happy birthday. Sorry I missed last week. I have a lot of tests coming up. You know how it is. (laughs) Talk of the goddamn devil. Duty calls. I love you. Yeah, I found her. Where else? The day of all days. We have a situation. You're needed, Evelyn. Don't you ever call me that again. Whoa, whoa, it's just a joke, Rose. 
can show you things even Chris doesn't know I can do. We have a clear shot. Stand down. I can handle it. She's just a kid. Way to keep it together, Rose. You're a lot like him, you know. I know. The father's story is now done. Hmm. The daughter's story is yet to begin. <laughs> Has begun. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> That's going to be the sequel. Chris is going to be Chris Redfield is going to be one old dude. You know, <laughs> during this time, it'll probably be about uh, I'd say eight? fifteen years later, right? Yeah, because he was uh, early twenties in Ari Ari one. Yeah, and and then that was nineteen ninety. And this takes place. Eight. Yeah, and this takes place. Twenty twenty one. Twenty twenty one. So that's like thirty oh, years. So it's fifty. So and then this is like so it'd be like sixty five maybe. 66. Maybe, like that, yeah, like yeah, yeah. Holy shit. <laughs> yeah, dude. That's what I'm saying. Like, you know, all, all the if we're continuing from this point on, all the cast of, you know, the OG games are uh, they're getting up there. Wait a minute. That means Chris was like in his late thirties, early forties in this game. Um no, the, he the, was the, in his forties, dude, in this game. Yeah, the Spencer Mansion incident was ninety eight, and this was twenty one. Yes, it's, so, yeah, it's, just it's, in his forties. In his forties, dude. <laughs> what the fuck? All right, so if this is in his forties, then yeah, maybe he's like late fifties, early sixties, right, right now where this is taking place. I pulled Ex you out of retirement for one last mission. <laughs> excited, excited. Uh, that's you know a lot will have changed in that time. It's continuing this story as well, so we, we're probably not going to be bouncing to see what um, Leon's up to and stuff, but I think that's what the RE4 remake, whenever that comes out, will be for. Um, yeah. Maybe we get to play as uh, Rose? Maybe we get superpowers? You know? Who knows? Who knows? I'll look forward to the next game. I'll look forward to the next game. Overall, yeah. I, I really enjoyed this game. There was just I've just got these gripes that I can't quite process right now. I'm gonna need time to to get on that. Yo, guys, if you have if you have stayed with us this long, thank you so much for watching. For real. Thank you, everyone. This has been a, a journey. This has been an adventure. Um We'll do more uh, of this. <laughs> yeah. We're gonna keep doing more. Um, we uh, stream at tt uh, twitch.tv slash the spooky memes uh, pretty much every day and uh, yeah just keep subscribe to the YouTube please and uh, maybe follow on Twitch uh, we're gonna probably I'm th I'm hoping uh, we'll play RE3 next uh, that's what I'd like to do dude if, if you'd be up for it um, you know me bro I'm up for anything hell yeah bro and we'll 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 get around them. We'll do them all. We'll do RE four. We'll do RE two. Uh, with us, you know, um, it'll be hype. It'll be hype. It'll be great. And maybe we'll go back to the older games as well. I'd I'd quite like to play through those. Thank you guys. Thank you guys. Yeah, Thank you so much. Then. Let's fucking let's press this button. What have I got? Complete challenges. Cool. Uh, got some movies. An extra weapon. I got a bunch of these challenges complete. Cool. <laughs> uh, 
yeah, I'll, I'll, I guess I'll, I'll save. Thank you. Village. And the menu's changed. That's... Yeah. Oh no, oh no, it's back. There it is. <laughs> it's back. All right, guys. Cheers. Let me press Bye, this. Bye, guys. Button. Peace out, guys. Peace.